Hey everyone, Mr. Toss with Mr. Toss 3D Print Shop. Um, just got another item here to review from Zyber VR, Zyber company. Uh, they had sent me two items. One was the all-in-one handles, which uh, I've already done the video for. And this one is for the dual handle extension grips for the Oculus Quest 2. This is a um, simpler version of the uh, all-in-one where it's just two handles. It doesn't have the weights and it has a little bit of a different grip, but we'll get into that. Um, currently, these retail for $30. Um, you can find them for sale right now for $25 on uh, Zyber's website. You can also use coupon code Mr. Toss for 20% off um, and check that out. So in the box, you get a nice little manual uh, with instructions on how the system works. You get some lanyards for the end of these controllers. And then you get two handles, a left one with red, a blue one in right, and then the ingenious clip hook, which works to secure the controller. So I'm just going to pull these out, set the box aside. And so these are the two handles you get in this system. They are lighter than the all-in-one because they don't have the weights in them, but they look like they could have been made with the weights. It's the same general uh, design, which is very smart of them. And it also uses a foam instead of a rubber. So it's got a nice soft grip to it. Um, you can kind of squish it and feel it. Um, and the controller install is as easy as can be. So you just take, I've got my right controller here. You line your the right hook and it'll have a natural fit on the controller. Slide it in and lock it down. You hear that click and voila, you can see it's nice form fitted in there and that's not going anywhere. So there's one. And then we can do our left. Again, the clip says left up top. Put it in where it form fits. Put it with the left controller. Click. And you are installed and ready to go. So now if you wanted to do Beat Saber, Ragnarok, drumming games, um, all sorts of different methods. You could even use this for uh, mini golf or normal golf. It's got enough room to grab a second hand back here and keep your hand on the controller. Um, they're nicely made, uh, good quality. And that's it. You get two of them. Now, I did want to see, would this work with a Quest 1? It is not listed on their site, so it is not advised by Zyber to use a Quest 1, and you would do so at your own risk. But I was curious. If you had a Quest 1, would it still work? So you can see it's not an exact fit on the cup, and it's not an exact fit on the hook. But if I put the hook in, and I lock it in, and it slides up, it's not going anywhere. It will fit and work with the Quest 1, in my opinion, but again, use at your own risk. But if this is pushed all the way down, this clip can slide off the end there. But as you're using these, it's not really going to slide. And so you could, theoretically, use these for uh, Quest 1 or Quest 2, but they are designed for the Quest 2. But that's it. And you see how easy it is to remove the controllers when you don't want to use them. You just push the little tab, and boom, they're off. You're good to go. Let's take a look at their website. So over here, this is uh, zybervr.com. This is their website. Um, you can, again, use the coupon code Mr. Tass for 20% off. Looks like they are offering a $10 discount for new customers with Hello10 for orders over $49. Obviously, the $30 or $25 that a single set of these are wouldn't reach that point, but you should still be able to use the other coupon code with the 20% off. And they carry a lot of different products. You can look here and see they've got cases, uh, desk stands, wall mounts, they've got charging cables, docks. In the game extension, they have the all-in-one, which I did a review for, and they've got the dual handles. They also have some gun grips, ping pong paddles. You can upgrade your head strap from here, face covers, uh, sweatbands. They even do prescription lenses which you could check into. And then they have about them, the blog and support. Um, looks like a nice company that's really starting to take off. Um, they're building nice products, uh, currently focused on the Quest 2. Perhaps in the future, they'll expand to some other headsets or different controllers as time and, uh, and experience allows. Um, but it's it looks like a nice set of handles. Um, we're going to do some gameplay videos here in just a little bit. Um, we'll show it in some golf and some Beat Saber and uh, be good. And they've been featured on some different sites there. So, yeah, looking forward to trying these out. And uh, stick with me. We'll be right back. Hey. 
So I started out with some walkabout mini golf, um, just showing that the, you know, you can there's room for your offhand to hold on to it. Um, gives you a nice place so it lines it up. Um, and it works really well. Um, I was hoping for a hole-in-one here, just off. But then I also wanted to show um, the angle. I set it to 40 degrees and walk about mini golf, and that gave you a pretty straight line. Um, you can do uh, similar types of settings in Golf Plus, which is what we're at now. Um, Golf Plus also has a really cool thing with the screen. You can play YouTube videos, but I also found that it now has a browser. So I was able to pull up the, uh, the listing in Zyber for these handles, just out of fun and curiosity. Um, but it worked great. Worked great for mini golf, worked great for normal golf. And then now I went into Beat Saber, give that a shot, which is what they were clearly designed for with the red and blue. So I made sure to stick with classic colors. And they work great. Um, they're having used the all-in-one version. I like the weight that the all-in-one version gives. And if you can afford the upgrade, um, it's twice the price of these. But if you can afford the upgrade, the all-in-one weighted handles and the general uh, grip and feel really uh, was was nice. And the ability to make it as a, a full, uh, like a kayak or a, a mall saber, um, by combining the two together. But these are very nice handles, and at $25 on sale, usually $30, I don't think you can go wrong. Um, gives you a lot of options to enhance your gameplay. So I was doing a little Ragnarok here. Again, just like Beat Saber, the handles work well, and actually having the distance and the weight of the controllers in front actually worked really well for this. So that's what I've got. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to future videos.